Tamasso Bay is located at Trumea, which is located in the area of Arndal, down south of Norway. The relatively large camping site includes all you need for an amazing experience. Weekend we're staying at Canvas Hove, so we're having two nights in two different places to stay, and I guess we're going to see what it's like. The first night at Canvas Hove we stayed in one of their luxury yurts. These are original yurts from the nomads of Mongolia. This is definitely glamping, with a big nice bed, a window with a roof, a bathtub, and even a small bathroom with an actual toilet and running water. Main course is hot, with cauliflower puree and asparagus. Dinner and breakfast were included, so no need to stress here. Kamasova also provides a large selection of activities, both with and without a guide, which you can sign up for. On our first night, we spent some quality time in a yurt, having a bath and just relaxing, because we had an early start the morning after. We're just about to start a trim around course. First time we're gonna do it, and we don't really know what we're putting ourselves into, but we're gonna find out. At least I don't think it's gonna be an issue with no wind! The Trimoran course was so much fun. We met up with our guide Magnus, who quickly went through the basics before we set sail. Turns out, it was way easier and more fun than we had believed. Two hours we had just flew by, and we both agreed that this is something we would love to do again. After our course, we went straight for our next adventure, two hours in the sauna. It was very hot and very relaxing. Quick shower and an ice cream later, and we were ready for a short walk around near the campsite, which is gorgeous and have several great paths, both near the sea and in the forest. Of course, we also had to try the bar, that you mix all sorts of drinks with and without alcohol, have several seating groups, and just a very chill vibe. After this, it was time to switch accommodation for the night. The next day was in the cocoon, a round tent up between the trees. The cocoon has a two and a half meters round mattress and some shelves, and that's about it. But it's a very cool and comfortable place to sleep, and it looks great on the gram. In order for you to appreciate just how big Kanasol really is, I figured I could make a quick time lapse just to give you sort of an idea. The ones of which we slept in the first night. Did you say that for the second night? the activity center, you can rent gear and activities, all very fun. In this area we have a little bar, that there, and we also have the saunas. And these are the tramorans. A fantastic weekend sadly is already over and it's time to head back to Oslo. We had heaps of fun and we hope you enjoyed watching us as well.